Hello, in this video we will see how we can fix the CSP error in Google PageSpeed Insights. So as you can see, uh, this is my website and uh, this is my website. I check the latest status of my website on this tool. It's taking a little bit of time so let's wait so as you can see the results is now present if I go to the best practices section this is the section where this issue uh, labeled as ensure CSP is against uh, effective against uh, XSS attacks so basically to fix this issue what we need to do we need to specify the CSP uh, property in our website uh, response either in the HTML uh, in the meta tags or uh, in the HTTP headers of the website so I will show you two methods first one is very easy so let's check this out I go to my website's code and uh, actually I implement the uh, implement the issue uh, implement the solution of the issue and I comment it down so I uncomment this I will provide the code in uh, in the description box this is the this is the tags that needs to be placed in the header of the website okay so if I uh, uncomment this code and save the changes this is the one way we can solve this issue okay as you can see the code is successfully saved so right now it's uh, coming under this okay so if i reload the issue reload the page so let's uh, check how this tool respond to its uh, correction its solution i go to the best practices section so as you can see this uh, uh, issue is still there okay so the issue is that if we specify this as a meta tag uh, the console show that uh, the page contains csp defined is meta tag as you can see i define the, the status in meta tag consider defining the csp in the header tag if you can okay so what we need to do we need to actually uh, put this particular uh, data inside the HTTP headers actually so I command this okay I command this uh, code and uh, this is actually the backend of the website how uh, we can uh, implement the solution so right now my website is of PHP Laravel based website so I do appropriate uh, things to uh, make the solution uh, uh, implemented so basically this is a middleware if we talk about the php website this is the middleware and i actually embed these headers actually into the, into the http headers okay so i implement this just let me remove this line this is not the so when you use so this is the one we need to use so basically we are providing that data inside the http headers okay so let's save the changes so if i go to the google page insights and reload this the status i go to the best practices section as you can see that issue is now showing up actually that issue is uh, moved to the not applicable section so let me show you this is uh, come under this section and show csp is effective against uh, xsxs attacks so basically this issue is now fixed so this is how we can fix this issue if you are having any question just let me know in the comment i will be happy to help you out okay thank you